Hey friends, so I'm filming today my skincare favorites and it will be all about my face this time. I will film another video with my hair care, you know, what I use for my body, for my nails. Keep in mind that this is my personal routine, you know, these are my personal picks, so what works for me may not work for you, of course. Even if you like, I don't know, take two girls with, let's say, oily skin, it's not guaranteed that the product will work the same on both. Okay, so to share my philosophy on skincare. Um, I think what you do before your moisturizer is crucial. Simply because, you know, if you don't do a proper cleanse, if you don't prepare the skin, everything is just ruined. It doesn't matter how good is your moisturizer, slash treatment, slash whatever. Also, I try to use products with good ingredients. Um, so I do invest in my skincare. Um, so of course some of the products are very expensive, I invest in everything I apply directly on my face really, um, but these just work for me, I have a really nice relationship with my skincare, so this is just what it is. I'm like on my second or third bottle slash jar, so I love them. And just to be clear, these were not sent to me. I bought them, I use them, I love them. Now my skin, I have a combination of things really. Sometimes my skin is dry, sometimes it's oily, sometimes it's normal. So I have like a bit of, I would say everything. Because of that I try to incorporate in my skincare, you know, products that are quite universal, that work amazing every time. A good cleanser for me is the one that is effective. So it takes off everything, leaving my pores clean, but at the same time is gentle enough so does not dehydrate my skin and leave it tight. And because cleansing is a very important thing for me, uh, you know, after wearing a full face of makeup, after filming tutorials, uh, I can double cleanse, uh, actually most of the times, uh, just to make sure, you know, I don't have anything left on my face. Now my top Cleansers are the Emma Hardy Moringa Cleansing Balm, the Omorovitsa Thermal Cleansing Balm and the Oskia Renaissance Cleansing Gel. I love a good cleansing balm, you know, the texture, the ingredients, how is the process really, because you need to massage it and then to remove it with a washcloth, I, I really enjoy it. And these really remove everything, waterproof makeup, I don't know, sunscreen. Now speaking about the packaging, I prefer the uh, Waskia one because it has a pump and it's actually a really nice one. And at first these are quite thick, but as you spread and work, uh, you know, the consistency around your face and neck, these really just melt. And to remove these bombs uh, after a few minutes, uh, I just use my uh, washcloth. This is from... Um, Emma Hardy, it is double-sided and I love this. I also need to mention my Vichy by Basic uh, eye makeup remover, uh, which I don't know where is the stuff because I bought a new one recently and yeah. I use that for my first cleanse, uh, just to remove makeup from my eyes and my lips, you know, something really waterproof and hardcore. Uh, so yeah, I love it. And also the La Roche-Posay uh, micellar water, which I use on a Q-tip to remove uh, makeup from my waterline. I have a serum that I like using before my moisturizer, of course. It's the uh, Apivita uh, Natural Serum for Hydration with Aloe and Hyaluronic Acid. Now, I found this brand in my local pharmacy and as far as I know, this is Greek um, and also it's very natural slash organic stuff. It comes, you know, in a typical glass packaging with a pipette. Uh, the consistency is very light and after applying this on the face, it transforms almost into a liquid. It seems quite refreshing, a bit sticky at first, but uh, after you blend this in, it's not. Now this next product is, I would say, the star of my skincare routine. It's the best moisturizer I've ever tried in my life. And I don't, it's just like my, my moisturizer. And I'm talking about my uh, Omorovitsa Balancing Moisturizer. 
I love this stuff. Very lightweight, it has a gel cream texture that absorbs quickly into the skin and at the same time is hydrating enough. It claims to reduce uh, the production of sebum, which it does for me, but again, I'm not sure about a super oily skin. Now, the best feature of this moisturizer, in my opinion, is that it calms down my skin. And what I mean by that is, for example, I, you know, after filming tutorials for two consecutive days, my skin is very irritated because you know, I use so many products and even after I cleanse my face, my skin is just very red and this stuff really calms everything and I love it. Because in the past when I was using different moisturizers, uh, you know, those will actually irritate my skin more. So this is definitely a very big plus for me. Packaging is classy, the bottle is heavy, the pump is good, uh, one pump is enough for face and neck. Also, it smells like a spa. All the Omorovitsa products smell amazing. You know that herbally, woody kind of scent, very natural and fresh. And this is actually a good moisturizer for men as well. So this is another plus. Now I came across this after buying something from Space Inc. and getting, you know, a bunch of samples as always. Uh, this is actually the story of, I would say, 70-80% of my skincare. So yeah, I love Space Inc. I call this the extra category because these are the products that I use uh, you know, in a specific moment for a specific problem, so not every day. To exfoliate my skin I use only acids, I don't like a physical exfoliant, I think the chemical ones are just the best because you know, acids uh, eat all the dead cells and work as much as they need to work. And at the moment I have two, the Ola Henriksen Lemon Strip Flash Peel and the Ren Glycolactic Radi Radiance Renewal Mask. I use this at night, once per week, uh, switching them, you know, from time to time. I would say that the Ola Henriksen one, it is stronger, so it's not for beginners. It has a very chemical lemon scent and it looks like a jelly, like a clear jelly, and the Ren one is very orangey, yellowish. Thing. And I apply this like for 10 minutes and then I rinse it off and I do the same with my Ren one. Really good chemical exfoliants and the Ren one smells nicer because it has a very sweet kind of scent. Another great product is the uh, Lucas Papau uh, ointment. Uh, this is a very thick balm. And I use it on my lips as a lip balm. I also use it on dry patches and blemishes because you know after you use a treatment on blemishes, you know after you use a treatment, um, those just have like a really dry, flaky skin around and because working on a smooth surface is better, you know, your foundation, your powder, looks better. I apply this for like, I don't know, 15 minutes, 20 minutes uh, and then I take it off and everything is just smooth and nice again. I do this when I have, uh, I don't want to say clients, <laughs> when I do makeup on other people and they have blemishes, usually they have that flaky skin around. Speaking about treatment, I use this stuff, uh, it's the Aven Triacneal. It has a very orangey and creamy uh, consistency. It's a good treatment, it works for me. Uh, of course, the blemish will not disappear in like one day, but four, five days. Um, and usually I get blemishes like in this area. I don't know why, it works. It's not amazing, oh my god, but it works. I also have a mask to show you, the Omorovitsa Deep Cleansing Mask. Everything about this mask is just, I don't know, just right. The consistency, uh, the scent, I adore it, again, like a spa. This is the only mud mask I've tried so far that doesn't dry my skin. I really like it. It is very refreshing. I use it uh, all over my face, you know, for like 15 minutes. Uh, or I can use it also as a treatment for blemishes overnight. 
Uh, I apply just a small amount on blemish and yeah. last thing is my avocado oil. I love this stuff. I use it on my hair, on my face, on my nails, everywhere. It is a very good oil and for my face I leave it like for uh, 20 minutes, two times per week just to nourish the skin and for my hair. Uh, I will talk about this in my hair care video. And these are my favorites. Thank you so much for watching guys and take care. Bye.